Hi, I'm Carl. So the show Catla is, is set in a 100% real town and is based on real events, or at least plausible events, that have or could actually happen, except maybe for the supernatural stuff. That's actually based on Icelandic folklore, and I think the show's creators, they have done an excellent job of bringing Icelandic folklore into a modern TV show. But enough about that before I start spoiling anything. Let's talk about Vík. Vík is an exceptionally gorgeous town with a myriad of activities for tourists, and it is not nearly as filthy as in the TV show. When you head to Vík from Reykjavík or the airport, it makes sense to stop at Sólheimasandur to hike to the abandoned plane wreck, although this is a difficult hike that takes about three hours back and forth. And don't attempt this hike if the weather doesn't allow it. Tragically, people have died on it in bad weather. I recommend shoes that support your ankles and layer up your clothes. The hike is beautiful and there is something about the plane in the middle of an endless sea of black sand that I can't quite put my fingers on. Make sure you book dinner in advance. The options for dining out in Vík are limited. I recommend Smidia and Brickles, great beer and excellent fried chicken burger. Oh, I want one now actually. Across the road is one of the main streets from the show Katla, although it's not quite as filthy. It is also the meeting point for the Vík zipline, which is absolutely something you must do. 5 out of 5 stars, no questions. A guided tour with geology and history lessons and jokes and everything. Exceptional guides who certainly work hard to ensure you have your best time possible, even though the activity itself would be a great enough. Make sure you visit Reynisfjara Beach, it's about 15 minute drive. It's an exceptionally beautiful beach known for its unique rock formations, black sands and exceptionally high waves, but be careful, the waves are deadly. The sneaky waves, and yes, that's what they are called, have claimed a few lives over the years. If you go into the ocean, you are unlikely to get back due to the high currents. And that is what happened to that girl from the movie Ring in the end. You can go paragliding in the beautiful mountains if you dare. I don't. There is a volcano museum which everyone recommends, but somehow it's always closed when I get there. Make sure you take a walk on the beach during sunset to see the sunset behind the beautiful cliffs. Enjoy your trip!